part of the thing that makes us come together so easily with with music and with um, with even just our conversations and what we what we enjoy together, you know, is that we sort of grew up together. I'm so sick already. Do we need to end on the set? Because it was, I think it's a lull in such a short period of time. I think if it would have went correct. It's cool because even like looking at the things that, yeah. like the way that our kids have a lot in common because we had a lot in common when we were growing, growing up in Flyleaf. <laughs> You know, things that we made really core and important about family, that was super important to the beginning of Flyleaf. Is that we would put family first. Man, I don't know. I'm excited to play music again, play the drums again. I haven't played the drums in years. And started a family, I have four kids now and they're just not realizing that I've played drums. Reconnecting with everybody has, has been enlightening and, and such a, a joy, you know, seeing uh, the level of maturity, the level of care every member of Flyleaf gives to their family, you know, to their, their significant other. Being so emotionally connected to a group of people is, is you know, Flyleaf really is special. So. At this point, we're not living together like we were for 10 years. Um, we're coming in and out of each other's lives as, you know, when I fly down here for practice. Getting back together with Flyleaf and uh, you know playing with my brothers and my sister again is something I'm really really looking forward to and um, also a little nervous about because it it's been so long and I haven't even <laughs> really played guitar like that in a long time so a little nervous but really excited. There's such a joy. There's such a, a synergy that comes from our history together. There's a lot of memories to sift through that are fun to talk about. In the basement for a week and we rehearsed every day, nonstop. Um, through a hurricane. Through a hurricane. I forgot about the and hurricane. He wasn't there. Yeah, he was had, on, out on business. So. And we had just became friends from him coming to shows in Texas. We'd never met his family. So it is really fun to be together. I do think there's also a lot of healing in it, soul-wise, you know. It's, pretty unbelievable just the feeling of playing together but then the opportunities that we've had I think that I can't say I had any control over that really um, I've tried to be just available to play the drums and just open for opportunity I felt like you know God was gonna take care of us opportunities in these songs you know I feel like came from God and I feel like the ability to to play together and when we do get together I mean I feel like it has to be from God you know I feel like God just opened the doors to 
to do things that we wouldn't have dreamed of. Yeah, it was pretty amazing. I can't believe the fans that we have that have stuck around <laughs> without us putting out any anything else. You know, it's been years since we've released any songs or anything and you know, it's been now 11 years since we've even played a show together with Lacey and everybody. And I can't believe the fans have just stuck around and still excited and uh I mean, it makes, makes me feel excited to, to have that fan group that still reaches out and there's all kinds of excitement at these shows. I don't know, I think getting back together now is just another part of that. You know, I've, I've just, even if um, it was just these few shows this year that we're, that we're putting together, I mean, it has to be from God because there's no way that it would have worked out this easy. So. <laughs>